Today we enter the twisted world of Karens, where their astonishing ability to summon managers from thin air and turn a simple request into an epic saga rivals the most elaborate soap operas. Get ready to witness jaw-dropping entitlement, mind-boggling demands, and a level of audacity that could make even the boldest superhero blush as we dive into the hilarious and outrageous universe of Karens Gone Wild. This Karen couldn't keep her big dog under control and let it loose in the dog park without leashes. When people confront her about it, she starts yelling like a banshee. And that's how you clear out the little dog park. Everyone went home. Yeah, he's still doing it. Dog just attacked two dogs. Go home, go home. She's not f***ing him home. Are you f***ing kidding me? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. We have like she clearly does not about this dog. That's Honey, are you irresponsible dog behavior? Yeah. No, she didn't get but you shouldn't even be putting him in this situation. She just left the dog part. And he's gonna attack another dog. Jackie, I'll see Come here, girl. Come on, baby. Are you kidding? I have the whole thing on tape. I'm gonna send it to the authorities. This Karen worker in the coffee shop loves cussing out customers and being disrespectful, but when confronted, she acts like she never did any of that. Seriously. Uh, what can I get for you guys? No, I, they know one going doing nothing until they bring a supervisor over here. And I'm dead serious. She's disrespecting she's a cussing, ten year old. She's talking. She's so, so I need a supervisor now. Because I wasn't being rude to you. I wasn't yelling at you or nothing. But once you disrespect my child, then yes, I have a problem. I was being very respectful to you. I wasn't raising my voice okay. or nothing. But you're going to disrespect my kid. This is over a cup, guys. No, you're disrespecting my over daughter. That's what it's over. Dude, first off, she's calling her a bitch. My daughter stepped she's... in. I'm trying to calm myself down after she disrespected my 10 year old daughter. We have so, witnesses here, so we can do that too. Oh, that's yeah, fine. Right. She, they could rewind the cameras. Do not disrespect my daughter, like I said. So I didn't Once say you, anything. What? She Man. was the one. You really want to say so? She started calling her bitch, and my daughter told her not to be disrespecting her tia like that. And would you she call started. Me? Uh, you are she started one. yelling at my 10 year old daughter. I didn't yell at her, first of all. I did not you said, yell at her. Who the fuck are you? Exactly. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. 
Not only that, regardless of how rowdy my sister and I was getting, she should not be customers that way. That's how Starbucks is representing Starbucks, and I will no longer buy shit from Starbucks then. But like I said, I wasn't disrespecting her. I wasn't getting out nothing. But once you disrespect my 10 year old daughter, regardless of how my 10 year old daughter's acting, that's when I got a fucking problem. And like I said, if she's gonna disrespect my 10 year old daughter, then she can take her ass outside so I can whoop her ass. And I'm not playing. Yeah, she needs to be recommended for the way she's acting. I, 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 I speak with her. I don't, I obviously was not here to see what I want her name. I want her name. It's Hannah. I want her name because I'm calling corporate. I want her name. And I'm serious. I want her name. And if she does not give me her name, I will take a picture of her and I will send it to corporate. Go ahead. Take a picture of me. She's not allowed to. We've got a wild Karen roaming the neighborhood, making a scene and bothering a delivery guy who's simply doing his job. Get out of here! Is this how you wake up? You wake up in this mood? Dude, I asked you a simple question. I asked you a simple question. No, now now we're gonna make you famous. This we got a Karen. We got a Karen me. over here. I'm He's literally making a delivery. This yeah. Guy's oh yeah, I'm assaulting him. Look, a I'm assaulting. Look, I'm Here's I'm making license. a delivery. I asked him a question and started yelling Here's at me. License plate. Yeah, it was my license plate. Rhonda, stop. Rhonda, Rhonda, stop. Rhonda, 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 stop it. This gang of Karens in the neighborhood thinks they can trespass onto someone's property and start shouting at them, causing a scene. I'm sorry, whose parents are these? They're whose not parents are these? Nothing. No, because no. my kid ever drove no. like those little shreds. My, my neighbor's This girl's so I'm classy. Sorry. You're so Give classy. Me, 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 so classy. Me, me, me. So why are you screaming at Give them if they're babies? Me. I don't no, care. You're gonna fuck I'm not gonna raise your voice at these minors they anyway. No, they don't have to. She doesn't have five year olds. I got three kids. Oh, I understand. But you, you don't need to scream. Okay. Do you want me to talk to you? What are you gonna do with it? Post on Instagram? It's just like, who Ashley, are you? Ashley, Ashley, so take me home. Goodbye. Home. Goodbye. We don't want you here anyway. Because my kid's gonna watch this. My yeah, son and it's so disrespectful. Ashley, no, yeah. no. You can get off of your, you can legit get off of our property before we call the cops. So you're fine, but she, if she's gonna be yelling, she doesn't need to be on our property. Get out, get out. This is our house. How many people drive? You, you are legit in our house. You can get you arrested. Go, go, go. You're so cute. Go. You won't believe it. Karen goes into full-on meltdown mode at the restaurant because she's given just one napkin for two sandwiches. This Karen started yelling at McDonald's.
Entitled Karen decides she's too important to wait in line at the store and tries to cut in, but she gets put in her place by the lady who wasn't having any of her nonsense. Keep talking, Karen. Just a little bit, huh? I know, bitch, because I won't let you cut my line. Oh, I won't let you cut the line, so I'm a chunk, Karen. You calling the police on me? Because I'm recording you. Being belligerent, trying to cut the line. Security! <laughs> oh, where's the fuck security? Say hi to the camera, Karen. Say hi. <laughs> this grumpy old male Karen in the neighborhood seems to have made harassing a lady his full-time hobby. Seriously, Grandpa, find another hobby. <laughs> Can I'm you sorry. please mind your own business? Yeah. Why you have to come over? Cannot mind your own business. You have to come over and tell skank. somebody Shut up, that skank. you don't like me. Shut up, skank. Shut you up, skank. You have to come and t you have to walk over. You, you can't mind your own business. She lives in, uh... Where do you live now? You don't even live You cannot here. mind your own business. You are the Karen of the neighborhood. Uh, I, uh, you have nothing better to do. I'm the Karen. To I'm the Karen. And tell the movers that uh, I'm a horrible person. You know what? Heart. When a big mouth lady tries to act tough in the store, she gets punched in the face by this crazy guy. Pass off your phone unless you're taping this for the news. Oh, my mama, nigga. Four. I got six kids, nigga. And they ain't gonna take my kids. I'm got a problem with the justice system. If you're taping it, put it on YouTube. Let me get a whole bunch of likes. And I swear to God, you're gonna be rich too. Like, <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, yo. Fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Fuck! Damn! Damn! Oh! Damn! Don't ever come out of the way. Oh! Okay. Damn! 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 This racist Karen believes she owns the whole neighborhood and goes ballistic, harassing a guy who was just trying to do his job. And we're allowed to have yard sales in residential areas. That's all right. I already talked to him. And that's why I got my license with the city council. So I already talked to Look, and I pay my taxes. No, no, get off the corner before we call the police. And I and I pay my taxes. So this I know I ain't getting them wrong. They already came. Get away, get away they, from they here before they the police. come over here. Yeah, get away from here. here. Get away from here. They were I'm already here. The okay, okay goodbye. Please call them. Please do. Don't please go by her them. car, worry. Stay right here. Stay right here. Now you are harassing us. Yeah. Because I know you have something more that you can do with your day than rather bother some people out here with a yard sale. This is not bothering you at all. And we got your license plate. This has nothing to do about destroying the city. This has nothing to do about a business. This has something to do about business. Okay. No, you're right. You're right. Leave them alone. Leave them. Whoa, there's a double dose of Karen in the airport. Two Karens screaming at each other like there's no tomorrow. It's like a battle royale of entitlement. Guys, you're shouting at an airport, you're obviously both from here. This is the most New York thing you could possibly be doing right now. <laughs> oh boy, here we go! Entitled Karen knocks on her neighbor's door and demands they cancel their 4th of July fireworks show because her dog doesn't like it. I'm having like a really hard time with it, and I really, really don't want to involve cops, like it is illegal. Like, have fun, enjoy the sparklers, all that, but like things that make loud... Set more fires than anything. Okay, well then don't do that! <laughs> But things that make loud noises, very suddenly, it's really hard. How long did you have a dog? Uh, almost three years now. So, three fourths of your life on the road, you haven't been smart enough to figure out a way to calm down. She's figuring it out, but she's got anxiety issues. I just wanted to 
but you know, they eat edibles. You go talk to your doctor. Okay, I it. hear you, but I just want to let so you know we are recording when it's happening. Okay, okay cool. Just wanted to make a request. Thanks so much. Happy four. You know, happy four. But you know, you're new to the neighborhood. You can't, you can't, you can't stop everyone else on the block having fun because you just moved in and you have a broken dog. And, and I am, it's, you know, happy 4th of July, 4th of July, so. We've got a male Karen in the neighborhood who completely loses it over a little dog barking. He goes on a shouting spree, trying to act all tough and macho towards the neighbor. a late night wine purchase at the store but the worker shuts her down by kindly reminding her about the law please bring your manager cvs you all can i have this bottle of wine no ma'am you cannot What did you say? State law says you cannot buy alcohol in the state of Indiana after 8 p.m. on Sunday. Okay. Bye. Did you get the name? Oh, now you're wearing my name tag. My name is David. Yeah. David? Mm-hmm. Okay. David. Make sure to look at my Google. Okay. 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 And what's your name again? Right there. Lauren. It's Lauren? Okay. Thank you, Lauren. Yeah. Have Bye. a good one. <laughs> This racist Karen worker gets all mad at some boys having a good time in the pool. So she starts hunting for any excuse to kick them out. It's under my brother my brother-in-law's name. So what we unfortunately we have some rules and the resident who lives here has to be here. He's a resident. He who I see the little boy with the dress right there. Are you out here messing with us because it's a bunch of black kids? Are you no. being racist because it's a bunch of black kids? No, this has nothing to do with that. That's We're what I feel like it is. Check. I feel like it's because it's a bunch of black kids out here. No. What? I got it. Yeah, and it says two guests. Are you a resident? No. What are you? Supervisor. You're a supervisor of what? I can help you. Um, who's the Who's the adult resident? Bryson. Bryson. Is he home? Uh, he's at work right now. Okay. So what we need to have but this he also lives here. Okay, so what we need to have is the leaseholder here. No, uh -huh. And then you're only allowed to bring two people with at the same time. Those are Okay, our so rules. he lives in a different apartment. He's my my son's friend. He has two guests and then Bryson has two guests. Okay, so the gentleman who's in the pool is he a leaseholder? Well, I'm pretty for sure his mom is. Where where does the rule say a leaseholder say a resident? On here it says, let me put this up on here. I'm putting this on Facebook. This is crazy. Residents and their guests. But you said the leaseholder. This says residents. So the gentleman that's in the pool, how old is he? And um, apartment does he belong in? He's 10. Hey. 
join the Karen busting squad by unleashing your laughter with a thunderous like, subscribing like a boss, and tapping here to unlock a treasure trove of hilarious videos that will keep you coming back for more.